He all skin folk, ain't kin folk. And he not even skin folk, but. <laughs> Hey y'all, it's Harry on and I'm back with another video. Now, before I begin, I really hope all my black followers are doing okay during this time. It's very scary and it's very hard for us, but I'm just letting y'all know we're gonna get through it. We're gonna get through it. So today's video, I was really kind of scared to make this because y'all know my content isn't usually we don't really talk about controversial topics. Like we do talk about controversy, but we don't talk about like controversy that's affecting the world like we talk about a little controversy that occurs on social media but this is a world issue we're going to be talking about the fraudulent sean king okay because side of the left i'm talking about sean king sean king a very active black lives matter activist he's, he's on the left of the democratic party here's what sean king tweeted out during the democratic primaries he says, I'll be frank and tell you two Democrats that I'm 99% sure I won't be supporting, primarily because of their dismal history on criminal justice reform over the course of their entire careers, Joe Biden and Kamala Harris. They both helped build and advance mass incarceration. So I got to admit, man, like, hey, this Sean King guy, man, he's pretty, he's pretty, he's... You know, it's pretty cool. When the protest started and the police came in and it was really brutal, no one heard anything about it from, from local news. It was all coming through social media. In fact, one of, the, one of the stations was actually airing a documentary about penguins. So this is why the symbol of the penguin with the fist in the air and the gas mask on is popping up all over the place in stencils and flyers. It's sort of like a, a, a symbol of the, you know, the failures of the media. I started taking photos and videos. And then all of a sudden, journalists started coming to me and saying, you're a really good journalist. And I was like, oh, is that, is that what I'm doing? Because I'm just trying to let everyone know what's happening around me. And they're like, exactly. Oh, what is this? There's another Tim Pool gets owned on Joe Rogan? No, it's just that he said that he's single because of feminism. Oh, that was a f great oh, Tim Pool. By the way. He went on Joe Rogan and he said, MAGA star who predicted 50 state Trump victory. He went out and he said, I'm predicting a landslide, all 50 states, including California for Trump. 